Come on. Later. Something I gotta do first. What? Catch you later. Wait, you've still got the battery. Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. See you back in class. Molly! Damn it, what the hell is she doing? So, dann würde ich sagen, gehen wir mal wieder zurück und gucken. Little help, little help here. Jetzt habe ich mich schon zu wieder erschrocken. and each other just yet. Let's get the hell back to the classroom. Give us a hand with these fuel cans. They weigh a goddamn ton. Hmm. Ich fast verreckt. Wer ich fast gestorben. You're back. Yeah, and we made out pretty good too. Great work, Kenny. How you doing with that door? Not so good. Here, let me give you a hand. Did you get that battery yet? Yeah, Molly has it. She should be back here soon. She'd better be. Ooh. So, was machen wir jetzt? Wir reden erstmal an. Mit Bree. Bri. Hey Lee, thanks for all your help back there. I don't think we would have made it without you. No problem. We're all on the same team. What do you think about this whole Crawford situation? I'd rather not talk about it. Too many awful memories. Even being back here gives me a bad feeling. Even now, with everyone dead? I got no sympathy for what happened to these people. They weeded out the sick and the old. Even children. Those least able to defend themselves so that they could save their own skins. Whatever happened here, however Crawford fell, I consider it poetic justice. Damn, girl, that's cold. It's how I feel. If you'd seen what I seen, feel the same. Hmm. So you're a cancer survivor, like Vernon and the others. Yeah, I was diagnosed when I was in college. Been getting treatment ever since. Just when I was starting to get better, when I thought there might be some hope, all this happened. <laughs> Lost my Oops. whole family. I'm the only one who survived. Funny how things work out, huh? <laughs> How long have you known Vernon? We must have him from Oscar for Oscar. Raus, ne? <laughs> he was really great helping me come to terms with my disease. But how do you come to terms with something like this? With a place like Crawford? I don't know what I or, or the other survivors would have done without Vernon. He's the one who held us together, kept us alive. I'm a little busy here, Lee. Maybe you should go get that battery or help with the medicine. So, dann gucken wir mal. Da ist sie ja die kleine Clementine. You okay, Clem? Yeah. This desk is just like the ones we have in my school. I know it's weird, but I kind of miss it being in school. 
Really? I would have thought school would be the last thing you'd miss about all this. No, I liked it. Huh. What was your favorite subject? History. Well, what do you know? Mine too. Where's Molly? She had to go run an errand. She'll be back soon. I hope she's okay. She'll be fine. She's pretty tough. Do you think things will ever be normal again? Just like the way they were before? I don't know, Sweet Pea. But we all have to believe they will. Remember what Katja said back on the farm? She said we'll all be home soon. And now she's dead. But we're not. We're still alive. And we have to keep hope alive, too. It's the one thing none of this can take away. Okay. So, dann würde ich sagen, gucken wir schnell mal darüber, was die beiden machen. What do we still need? We already got the fuel and the battery. Once we find some medicine, we'll be good to go. So where's this battery you found? Molly has it. She ran off to do something. Well, she'd better bring it back here. I don't know why you trusted that girl with it. We hardly know her. She saved your life, didn't she? <laughs> yeah. But what has she done for me lately? No, wait. There is something you can help me with. Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. He's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ben, come on. This again? It's my fault Duck and Katja got killed. If I hadn't screwed up back at the motor inn, they'd still be alive. How am I supposed to just carry something like that around? I have to tell him. Hmm. I agree. I think you should tell him. Just not now. You don't get it, Lee. What am I supposed to do whenever he talks about Katja and Duck? Just nod and pretend like it wasn't my fault. I can't do it anymore. Ben, listen. Kenny seems like he's got his shit back together because right now he's got a purpose. But he's still in a real bad place. You tell him now, he's gonna lose it. And then we're all screwed. There'll come a time when he's ready to hear it. But it's not now. Not yet. I hear you. Wird Ben nicht mehr unter uns weilen, weil Kenny dann wirklich ihn wahrscheinlich nicht aufs Boot lässt. So schätze ich jetzt mal die ganze Situation an. So, wo müssen wir jetzt hin? Wir müssen jetzt eigentlich auf Molly warten, ne? Oder auf die anderen beiden. Kann man jetzt hier rausgehen? Nein, man kann rausgehen. So, wir müssen jetzt... Okay, wir müssen eigentlich zur Krankenstation wahrscheinlich mal gucken. Aber... Mm -hmm. Wäre es Stießwaffe? Gucken wir doch gerne mal rein. Also, letzten sind wir ja rechts rum. Genau, Ash. Ist das euer Ernst? Kann er nicht alle erschießen? Ich sehe es aber immer die Waffe verzogen hat. Ich hatte nur ein ganz leichtes Stück und auf einmal. What the hell happened? They wandered into the hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. What about the meds? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. 
Looks like they were keeping all the prescription meds in that safe, locked up tight. Ja, ja, lacht ihr nur über mein Aim. <lacht> Können wir ihn aufbrechen? No way we can bust it open. Maybe with enough time, but I don't know how much of that we have. Be a hell of a lot quicker if we just knew the four-digit combination. Well, I doubt they just wrote it down and left it here for us to find. We should just try busting it open. We don't have any other choice. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. Fangen, fangen wir denn an zu suchen? Ist ja nicht so, dass hier im Korridor, glaube ich, nicht. Just a bunch of papers. No safe combination, though. What is this? A copy machine. Not that it matters with no power around here. So, was haben wir hier? Du sollst dich auch nicht ausruhen, du sollst auf dem Bett gucken, weil da was lag. So, was haben wir hier noch? Da. What's this on the floor? It's a sonogram. Looks pretty sturdy. No way we're gonna force that open. We might be able to find something to pry it open, but it'll take time. We don't have time. Omid needs that medicine. We have to get it open now. Aimt ihr mal mit dem Controller, dann wisst ihr, was ich meine. Already cleaned out. Was haben wir hier noch? Y'all already checked these drawers? Yes, Lee. Nothing in there worth taking. There's dried blood on this printout. And on the floor. Looks like that trail of it from the safe to the camera over there. Then out the door. What the hell happened here? No tape inside. Hmm. The way this camera is set up, it looks like it would have had a pretty good view of that keypad. But I wonder if it caught someone punching it in. Ah. Anna Correa. Guess she must have been a patient here. Ach, guck mal einer, schau. I think maybe we just got lucky. That'd be a first. Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547. Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh God, oh God, oh God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm going to give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. I don't want the procedure. I want my baby. I can't do this. I can't do this. Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow, or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. Hmm. Damn it, we almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Maybe you should search it. See what he's got on him. Oh my god. Ja, 
Der Witz ist, wie wir vorhin gesehen haben, ähm, war es ja im Endeffekt so, dass, wir, dass sie ihn nicht getötet hat. Er hat sich ja noch bewegt, das heißt, er wird hier irgendwo noch rumeiern. Der, der liegt bestimmt nicht draußen, ich kann mir das gut vorstellen. Bin ich mir sogar hundertprozentig sicher, dass der nicht mehr da draußen liegt. Na, ja, hab ich doch gesagt. Puh. Alter. Blödes Kamel. This might be just what we need. And what's this? Looks like some kind of code. But Vernon said the safe combination was only four numbers. Hello. Shit, time to go. So, jeder weiß, dass die ganze Zeit versuchen. Schließfach aufzumachen. Ich gehe mal davon aus. So, jetzt wissen wir Bescheid, ne? Found two more tapes. One of them is dated October 10. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive? To keep on living? If this is what it takes. If this is what it's turned us into. I don't make the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you. Please help me. Maybe one day when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. I think we know what happened to Crawford. More importantly, we got the combination. <laughs> Krista, are you all right? What's wrong? It's nothing. That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. All right. Mm. Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. We're in business. Antibiotics, morphine, 
take as much of this as we can carry. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You know, I found a third tape in the locker outside. Maybe there's something else on there. We got the meds for Omid. That's all I care about. We'll head back to the classroom. Don't take too long, Lee. Weiß, was auf dem Band sein könnte. Zumindest gehe ich mal davon aus, ich weiß ungefähr, was drauf ist. Bin ich mal gespannt. Ich sag doch, ich wusste es. Wenn es so war, ich muss einen Start zu diesem kleinen Arrangement setzen. Das ist das letzte, was ich dir geben kann. Warum? Oberson hat jemanden hier gestern hier gestern in die Inventur genommen. Er ist wirklich krachig. Ich kann es nicht riskieren. Wir hatten einen Vertrag. Ja, wir hatten einen Vertrag. Wir haben es nicht mehr. Meine Schwester braucht diese Medizin. Ohne sie wird sie sterben. Oder sie wird sie zeigen Symptome und sie werden sie wegnehmen. Ich kann das nicht lassen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? Well, shit. So. Ich konnte mir schon denken, dass hier irgendwas damit zu tun hat, dass hier in Crawford, sag ich mal, gewohnt hat. Aber, und dass der Arzt irgendwas mit ihr gemacht hat, auch wahrscheinlich die richtige Bestätigung. Aber... Alter. Sightseeing. I'll take that battery now. Oh, yeah, uh, about that. I'm just kidding. War das letzte Band jetzt davor oder danach? Das war davor. Here you go. Auf jeden Fall. What's that? Nothing. Can quit with the act, Molly. I know you're from Crawford. What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. Why'd you lie to me? I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? Are we really gonna do this now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place or in their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret. Kept her safe for as long as I could, but in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked. How anything was better than becoming one of them. But I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Before they came and took my sister away. This is all I have left of her. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Molly. I understand. She's pretty. What the hell? I think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. Oh. Hmm. Jesus! Shit. Ben, sorry, Alter. sorry. I just got spooked by those bells, and then I heard someone coming. Kenny and I still can't get the door open to the armory. He sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Uh, Ben? 
Where did oh. you get that? Oh. I just found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway back there. 